All right, what's going on everyone? ZJZoids here, and today I just want to kind of go over what I basically did with my Redler Custom. I'm going to give it the name Vindicator, I guess. That's a good name for it. I don't know. I might change it. Who knows? Anyways, um, so pretty much this was one of my fastest customs to work on. There's a dog barking in the background. I cannot stop it. It's not mine. All right, so uh, for the most part, I wanted to give this thing something like a cobra a helicopter cobra apache slash a zoid look to it okay so like you know flying guns being able to hover in areas go into missions and shoot around all right so one of the things i gave this redler is add a a point on the back underneath the tail to give it this turret gun because for the most part redlers in zoids the anime itself they usually get easily taken out from the back they're not the fastest flying zoids out there so to reduce that i decided to equip it with a turret on the back right so that's one of the things so i used three different kind of joints for this project uh, one of them being the hero factory from lego uh, on the legs the hips area those are known as aso blocks a-s-o-b-l-o-c-k-s and i'm gonna give credit to maethias who is a great zoider uh, you should check out his page and <clears throat> and definitely that you know because of him using those joints I, uh, I i also started using it and they're really great for projects okay so uh that's pretty much the main two actually and the the third one is the lego joint i know hero factory and lego joints are pretty much the same company whatever but the Lego joints are these smaller micro-sized ones, right? So there's three different types of joints, okay? Those are found on the wings and on the neck part, right? So now for the weapons, this here, it's an electronic part. Actually, I customized it. I forgot the name of it, but it's something that you would run wires inside of it. I decided to kind of work around it and make it look like missile pods. And this here, this is the end piece of a Reynos tail. I have two scrap pieces of from Reynos and that I turned into dino types uh, in the past and I was left with two tail ends and I didn't, I didn't even notice it until when I was making this custom looking for parts so I made them in two long range guns to attach underneath the wings right uh, for the claws basically I just use styrene sheets cut them make them shape like claws triangular shapes so they can kind of have those sharp edges claw like thing and if I'm correct, I think the Redler is a, uh, a, a, a what you call those things, the wyverns, those those eastern type of dragons. Uh, I think that's what they are, not just like a dinosaur or anything like that, if I'm correct. You can correct me in the comments section, right? So uh, the whole idea behind this Zord, this build, was to uh, give it some guns, more guns than it usually would have. Um, give it the military look to it, give it some boosters. It's got some speed to it and articulation overall, kind of like to maybe if ever they make an hmm to it then it would look something like that i hope so right so a lot of parts there was hidden i'll go over the weapons and the capabilities in another video but of course if you enjoy this kind of content like share and sub and i'll catch you guys in the weapons and capabilities video when i have them up right so stick around and thanks for watching see ya